It is June 2016 and I am lucky enough to be in a flint pit with Mr. Roy Miller on his property here in awesome Glenford, Ohio. Roy has discovered this head right here and he's going to give you an overview and a description of what we've got going on. It's all yours, Roy. Okay, this is, this is a head that uh, I found and it's about a foot and a half, had a foot and a half a cover on it. And the Indians worked on it. You can see where they knocked sections of it off. And this whole top, they skimped the whole top. That's what they were getting with hammer stones. They could not break the cortex. So they, this is what they left. And this is usually what we have left over from what they tried to get. And not all of this will be good, but there'll be sections of it that'll be good flint. And you can see, here's the hammer stone. This is more of a smaller one, but they have a basketball size, what they use to break these knobs. Like this was a big knob, and they busted it off, and you can see the green flint, the orange. So. Now when you, you heat that, those reds and those blues and a little bit of greens will really get green for you, won't yeah, they? Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. No. Well, they dug what they could, so what we're going to do is put the hydraulic hammer on. And we're going to see if they just left it because there was no good flint here or if they left it because they couldn't get it anymore. But well, that's about it until we do some more on the, with the hammer. All right. Great looking hammer stone, as Roy described to me. That's worn down. And it was left right there, just like a picture in time. Another thing, Roy, I... I asked him, he was describing cortex to people who are new to this. And if you come down to here, Roy, could you give me like a description of what your cortex is here? A little bit of cortex, you can see it's about a half an inch. And sometimes it, it, there, it, there's more of it because you can see it even here, it's like layered. A cortex it's got one layer, so when you hit this with a hammer stone, it won't budge the underneath layer. That's why they couldn't break it. You had to break the first layer off before it just bounces. That is Flint Anatomy 101, as told by Mr. Roy Miller.